and welcome back to my channel. So today I want to make something uh, easy and fast since I am 8 months pregnant, actually very close to 9 months. So I'm going to make an air fried chicken using this Hamilton Beach air fryer and then I'm going to make a um, mashed sweet potato and a cucumber salad. So let's start maybe with cucumber salad. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this knife to cut the edges and then I'm going to peel it. And now I'm going to grate the tomato, uh, tomato, the cucumber. Here. Maybe I'll cut it in half since it's the big. into already prepared like there's like two tablespoons of sour um Greek yogurt you can also use sour cream and, and one teaspoon of um dry dill which I love so this is gonna go in here together and that's gonna be our salad very easy and very good I really love it this is actually um, very popular salad in Poland if you ever gonna go there most probably you're gonna have um, this kind of salad um, in the menu at the restaurants so this is really good and very also refreshing great for summer I love it in summer this is the best <laughs> You can of course uh, add more sour cream or less or more dill or less dill. And also I'm adding some Himal pink, Himalayan um, pink salt. And I'm gonna mix it up together and it's done. So the salad is ready to go. So now I'm gonna get to the, um, sorry. <laughs> Um, the sweet potato. What I love actually about this knife is very sharp, which I love. This is actually from the brand called Kotai. I hope I said it right. And it's made with Japanese stainless steel, so you can believe me and trust me that it's really sharp and very good. So I'm gonna now peel the sweet potato. This is the potato, so I can boil it. I really love that this knife is so sharp because it makes it so easier and quicker to make things. I think that the most important thing in the kitchen is to have a sharp knife because it really helps with everything. And he also want to cook more, because why not, right? <laughs> okay, and now I'm going to put the potatoes into the pot. I already fill it with water, so I'm going to just put it in. And I'm going to put it on the stove and let it cook. Once it's going to be very soft, I'm going to make it actually with maple syrup and butter. Actually, I put too much water. So, as I was saying, I'm going to add, like you can see here, um, one tablespoon of maple syrup. And I think this is actually one tablespoon of butter as well. I did like, you know, press minus. And I'm going to put it together. Once the potatoes are warm, I'm gonna add some Himalayan pilks, of course. And then, like I said before, I'm gonna smash it and mix these two. Smash it more with the fork because I really like it really nicely. 
smushed. And, and that's it. And so and then we just have to wait for our chicken, which was actually pretty nice. I think we're getting there slowly. So we air frying because um, we really like this crunchy taste of chicken. And we're gonna put it nicely on our two plates and add the salad and the potatoes and enjoy our dinner. So I just took out the chicken from the um, air fryer and I'm gonna just put all over it um, some barbecue sauce, golden barbecue sauce that's organic from Primal Kitchen. So I'm gonna put some of it in the bowl to make it easier. And then I'm gonna use this brush. And I'm gonna... Wow, it smells nice. Oh, I like this one. <laughs> and I'm gonna just nicely put it all over the chicken. Hmm, I really like this one. Actually, we, we never tried this one, so I'm curious, but the smell is very promising. The chicken goes back to the air fryer. I'm just gonna open it. Put it just for 20 minutes. Um, let's do it 15. Okay. So we're gonna wait. So I have already boiled potatoes, so I'm gonna add to them butter and put it, try to put it like under the potatoes and cover it so that the butter is gonna melt. And after some time, I'm gonna smash it. I already put the cucumber salad on the plate, so this is already ready. The chicken is uh, very getting, getting very crispy. So this is gonna be done soon, and it'll be all done and ready to eat. So let's wait a little bit for this. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna smash it right now. Why wait? So. Do that first. I always do this first and then I'm just fix it a little bit with the fork and of course I'm gonna add maple maple syrup to this to make this a little more sweeter. <laughs> oh the smell of the maple syrup. Oh I love it. So now I'm gonna put it on the plate, and the one and the other one. Oh, I thought this is chicken is on the plate. I always love potatoes, so I always put them in my pot. Maybe a little more on this one. Oh, and the chicken is done! What a great time! So let's take it out and I'm gonna cut it on the board. I actually flipped it. In the meantime, halfway, <laughs> flipped it halfway. <laughs> and okay, so when it comes to chicken, my favorite part is, of course, the leg. So I'm gonna take the leg, oh, and cut the bone. Okay, got that. So that's gonna be mine. And my husband's favorite um, part of the chicken is breast. So let's give him a nice piece of breast. Wow, this is very, very nice. Actually, I'm gonna do it this way. Do 
I'm gonna put too much bones. I'm just gonna cut it nicely and put just the meat. Oh. And that's it, perfect. Hmm, which one is nicer? <laughs> they both the same. And that's it, I hope you can see. And now we can enjoy dinner. Very easy, very fast and also healthy, isn't it? I think it is healthy.